Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and in this video I'm going to show you the simplest way to complete this lab. So first of all, just simply log in with your credentials and once you're done with that, just simply come back over here, click on the checkbox and then just simply click on agree and continue. Now just simply wait and just simply activate your cloud shield. It will take a couple of seconds so just simply wait for that. And now just simply click on continue. Now in the description box of this video, I will share all these commands. So basically what you do, you have to come back to the lab instructions and click on the task number three. And from here you can see this region. So just simply copy that, come back over here and just simply paste over here like this way. Make sure that there is no extra space after equal to. Now just me copy all this command like this way, copy like this, come back over here, paste, hit enter. Wait for a second and then just me click on this authorize over here, like this way. Now this command is going to take at least 5 to 6 minutes, so make sure that your laptop will not go for a sleep. Otherwise your cloud should be disconnected and because of that you might face a necessary error. And once you're done with this command, then you are done with the 90% of the lab. You don't have to do the task from the task number 1 till task number 5. We have to complete the task number 6 manually. But don't worry about that. I will show you the easiest way to do that. And it's a very easy task. So now just me wait for this command get execute.
and it's finally done now once you're done with that just me come back over here and click on the task number six now here you can see set up a iap now just me open this link in incognito window like this way wait for a second now just me choose your project now click on this enable api and then just me click on this go to identity now click on this configure button like this way and then just me choose external and then just me click on this create over here now for the application name just me type quick lab over here and for the username just me click over here and from here just me choose that now again just me scroll down over here now here you can see developer contact information for that just me copy this username copy like this come back over here and paste over here that's it then click on the save and continue wait for a second and it's done scroll down click on the save and continue again click on the save and continue and then click on this back to dashboard and it's done now just me come back to this tab and refresh your page now just me turn on this toggle like this way click on the checkbox and then just me click on this turn on now it will take a couple of seconds so just me wait for that and it's finally done now just me click on the checkbox over here like this way wait for a second now and then just me click on this add principle over here now just me paste the same username which you just copy from here this one okay so it's done now for the role come back over here scroll down over here and from where you can see this role iap secured web app so just me copy this role over here and make sure that you do not copy any extra space otherwise you are not able to find that role so copy like this come back over here paste and then just me click on that role now click on the save and continue just me wait and it's done now if you just me come back over here and click on the check my progress for each and every task you will get a score without any issue and if the score is not updated for any particular task no need to worry just me wait for a couple of seconds and you will get a full score on this lab without any issue just me wait and watch so as you can see on my first time i was good at the score if you are not able to get a score no need to worry wait for a couple of more minutes and you will get a full score on this lab for sure and that's a way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section Thanks for watching and have a good day guys.